Hey everybody, welcome back to my channel. I'm Ms. Roxanne, and welcome to my channel where I talk about random stuff. I also like doing death smashes, and doing this, and doing that. I like to tell stories. I just like, di I like different uh, topics. I like to talk about them. So, welcome, and hopefully you'll stay. So, I want to tell you about the time I went to California, which was, holy crap, seven years ago? Wow, that was a long time. So, um, basically... We're going to start off how I got there. So I, I went by plane. And here's the thing. I'm from a hot area. I went in August. And it was 85 degrees at 4 a.m. It was, it was hot and muggy. And so I was wearing like shorts. I was wearing like a short suit shirt. And so where, where I'm from, I got to do, we call it a puddle jump. Because we go from my airport to a bigger airport. Then from that airport, we go all the way to Los Angeles. So we call it a little puddle jump. Because it only takes like 45 minutes. Compared to like three and a half hours. <laughs> so basically, we then I get to California. It's like 11 a.m. or something like that. It's cold. It is freezing cold. I was like, what in the hell is August? It should be at least 75 or 80 or something. No. It was straight up 64. I was like, oh my God, I need my hoodie. Where's my hoodie? And it was in my suitcase, and I was waiting for that to come out. So, um, and my cousin, she actually came out and met me because that's where she was living at the time. She doesn't live there anymore. So, um, I met her. She finally got to me because she was actually leaving an interview for her job. And then the first, literally the first thing we did was we drove all the way to the Hollywood sign. We got as close as we could, and I actually got my picture taken with there. And I'll see if I can throw up a picture I'm not very good at it, but we're going to see if I can put it up. So, you may not see my face. <laughs> but, uh, here's the picture. So, now I got me a mail note to add the freaking picture. So, anyway, so we got really close there, and then we literally just drove around them and went for lunch. It's this really weird restaurant. It had a bunch of naked people on it. I don't know the name of the restaurant, but it, was, it had really good food, though. Like, really good food. That's another thing you'll see. I love to talk about food. Food. Oh my god. I could tell you about 50 stories about food. Oh my god. Seriously. Anyway, so that was super delicious. And then my cousin was super nice. She slept on the couch and I got to sleep on her bed. And so the the next day we... we bit, she had to go to another interview because she, like I said, she was trying to get a job at the time. So I stayed and watched TV for about a couple hours, and they had a marathon of Pretty Little Liars, which I never saw before. And then I got hooked on that show. Because I watched, like, four episodes. No, well, I watched, like, two episodes. I was kind of hooked then. <laughs> and so um, after we, she came back, we decided we are going to just drive around and just go look at places. So we went to, like, um, downtown L.A., so we got to go see, like, the... The Walk of Fame, and so you get to see all the stars and stuff on over there. And then we just got to drive around, and then we went to um, a, a couple of souvenir shops. And that's where, um, so if you see me like in a gray t shirt that's like a crew neck, it's my Hollywood shirt. It's really faded now, but I still love that shirt, so I, I still wear that like all the time. And we decided to just walk around, just Oh, we also went to a record store because um, I love CDs and I love um, buying singles of songs. I love those because I love remixes. I am obsessed with remixes. Like, you don't understand how obsessed I am. Anyway, so we went to a couple shops there. And then we just drove around because everything was just so new to me. It was so awesome. And so the next day, we decided to... Um, let's see, what did we do that day? Uh, we went. We met my other cousin who lives in um, Santa Monica, one of those Santas, <laughs> one of those. And so we met up for lunch at um, Universal Studios, and no wait, it was um, Disneyland. We went to. I can't remember if it's Disneyland or Disney World. I feel like it's Disneyland that's in California. It's cram me down in the comment section if I'm wrong. So we met my cousin there. So we all all three of us ate on lunch and. Then we went on all the rides, and then I went on the Super Sonic, or, um, not Super Sonic, sorry, wrong theme park. We went on Space Mountain. 
It was literally so much fun. It's like one of the best roller coasters. It's all inside. And they have all these like fake stars and stuff. And it was literally the coolest thing ever. I was so excited about that. It was literally so much fun. And then we went to... Um, where else did we go? Uh, I think that's all we did that day. And then the next day... I was there in like a week. But then the next day we went to Universal Studios. And then... Um, so we got to go all all around. Of course, I bought a bunch of souvenirs at both places because they were both so much fun. But um, I remember also we went uh, we went in the haunted the haunted I, I don't know this little haunted place at Universal Studios. We were one of the first people in our group, and me and her got so damn scared. We literally ran so far ahead and caught with the other group. That's how freaked out we were. And I swore to myself I would never do that again because that was hella scary. And then we went to, um, uh, then we did the tour um, around the lot, which was so cool about, around Universal Studios and got to see all that type of stuff. So that was super awesome. I really liked that. Got to see with Studio Lane. We got to see Jaws. We got to see all this other awesome stuff. I really loved it. And then we went to. That's all I can kind of remember Universal Studios and what else? What? Uh, uh, so the next day, uh, we decided uh, she's going to teach me how to surf with one of her friends. So we went to the surf shop and you literally have to be like a Power Ranger because like the water is hella cold in the Pacific Ocean. So I had to get a, a wetsuit and I'm kind of a big guy. Big guy. Sorry. I was, actually, I was a lot skinnier back then. I wish I was still skinnier then. I am now. So anyway, um, so we got a, a wetsuit, and then we rented a surfboard, and so we went surfing. And actually, I got to, I tried, I think like three or four times, and I finally stood up, like maybe for like ten seconds. But I felt so accomplished, I was so excited, and then I fell off, obviously. Then I stood up like a couple more times, but not that great. Still, so much fun. And then um, after that, we got lunch, and then. Um, then we went and changed, and then we went to, we were going to the Santa, Bar, Santa Barbara Zoo, one that, I think it's Santa Monica, somewhere up in there, <laughs> going to the, the, the big zoo that I know the guy in California. Uh, unfortunately, we got there too late, so we kept on driving, we, went, we actually went to a casino. i never been gambling before, and I played blackjack, and I literally won like $150. It was so fun! I gotta play. I gotta be the thrower at the craps table. That was really cool too. I really like that. And so I won like I think like twenty bucks on that too. Of course I got destroyed on the slots. Got utterly destroyed. And then that was my yeah that was my last day. And then um uh, we also stopped at the at some type of pier. It wasn't the Santa Monica pier, but it was just a different pier. And just hung out for a little bit and watched the sunset. And so that was a lot of fun. And then the last day was just kind of chill. And then the next, then the last day is when I left and came back home. And my abs were on fire from surfing. Because <laughs> I was so sore. <laughs> but it was literally one of the best trips I've had. And I really, really did enjoy it. So um, I'll probably include some pictures and stuff and do like a mini little slideshow thingy. Maybe. If not, it won't be in here. So anyway, it was literally so much fun, and I hope you enjoyed me telling the story because it was literally one of the best trips I've had. So if you like this video, please go to like, comment down below, and I'll see you on my next video. Bye, everybody.